Netflix and Disney and Amazon all apparently have preview clubs and we never got invited. I know. I know. Because the most important phase of launching a product is the pre-launch. Jack, if we're going to talk about clubs, we got to talk about our favorite quote ever when it comes to clubs. What is that quote? I would never want to be a part of a club that would have me as a member. Groucho Marx, I would never want to be part of a club that would have me as a member. This is great. Well, the Wall Street Journal just told us about Netflix's preview club. We're not talking about like your movie buff buddies who just watch trailers on the first Saturday of every month. <laughs> Although that sounds like a fun club. I might get in on that. Let's get invited on that one too. The Netflix preview club is a select elite group of Netflix subscribers who get invited to see Netflix content Months before everyone else does. It's like the SEAL Team 6 of streaming. Jack, Squid Game Season 2? Uh, Netflix Nancy in Nebraska already got a sneak peek. Yes, Netflix Preview Club gets previews of the top Netflix movies and shows on one condition. You can't spoil the ending for anyone. <laughs> yeah, don't tell anyone about the show. But actually, the main condition is a little different. The main condition is you got to tell Netflix what you thought of the movie in great detail. The key of the Preview Club is give Netflix feedback so they can tweak the movie. And here's what fascinated Jack and I. It turns out that Netflix's preview club uh, isn't new and uh, isn't the only one. According to Variety, it's been around for over a year at Netflix. And Netflix has already improved movies based on feedback from members of the preview club. Jack, apparently the first rule of preview club is you don't talk about preview club <laughs> and nobody spoke about preview club. For example, the preview club was already used for the movie Don't Look Up, the Leonardo DiCaprio movie on Netflix about the meteor coming to planet Earth. And the preview club members said that Don't Look Up was too serious a movie when they checked it out. Right, and they checked it out months before we all got to. So the creators had time to act on that feedback and add some funny parts. Yeah, Jack, like this random <laughs> Joan Hill scene just in the Oval <laughs> Office in the middle of the movie. Boom, out of nowhere. That's from the feedback from the preview club. And Netflix's Don't Look Up ended up getting nominated for an Oscar. Now, this makes sense because a typical movie films 20 hours of footage for each one hour that makes the final cut of the movie. So, Jack, for every one scene that's actually in the movie, the director had like 20 scenes to choose from. Yeah, so the director makes a bunch of decisions, but then they get feedback from the thousands of preview members. The director might swap out one scene for another one. Yeah, what we're saying here is that Netflix is basically just crowdsourcing the final version of all the movies you're watching on Netflix. Yeah, kind of. Netflix is turning its audience into its editors. Yeah, kind of. And it's not just Netflix that seems to be doing this. Amazon Prime Video is doing this. Hulu is doing this. Preview clubs are the new rage. Jack and I are literally not invited to any of them. So, Jack, what? We've gotten zero invitations. The takeaway for our buddies over at Netflix. The most important phase of a launch is the pre-launch. Yetis, Jack and I are huge believers in the importance of creative instinct. Going with your gut and pulling with that gut. Creators decide with their artistic gut what is going to be compelling and then they make it. Yeah, but feedback, it's a gift. It's a data point. It improves the product. So why would you wait until after you've launched the product? The optimal moment for feedback is before the launch. So you have time to improve it before launch. Entrepreneurs often ask friends and family to try out a product first. Tell them what they think. Established brands do focus groups, grabbing random people off the street and paying them to try out the product and give their opinion. Netflix kind of kicked this up a notch. They created a preview club that people are actually excited to join. It's kind of an awesome way to get feedback. It is. The most important phase of a launch is the pre-launch. Thanks for jumping in T-Boy style. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more pop biz that you need.